now what we're doing, we're going to go into another process now. This is copper plated and we're killing the cyanide that's on it. We're rinsing it off here. Now we're going to go into a nickel bag. You got to drain no matter where you go, whatever excess water that might be off. And the first thing you got to do is change the AC current to DC current. It's like your car battery. That's a DC current battery. So we have to change the current from the wall current to DC. And what we, how we do that is by rectifier. Now, we can't plate at 110, 120 volts because we would burn the wood completely. So we got to plate at something from zero to 12 volts. That's what these guys do. Now this is a nickel tank. And you can see what I'm going to do here is this piece is actually pop it up. It's got a copper flash on it. Now depending on what the piece is depends on how long we have to stay in the nickel for. Now we're going to go in the nickel. And it's going to be on there. You got to watch out for the voltage so you don't burn it. Now it could stay in there for one, two minutes. It could stay in there for a half hour depending on what it is. Of course, what thickness we want to put on too. <laughs> so uh, now what we're going to do, it's only been in there for about maybe 40 seconds. But we're going to show you exactly how quick it does go on. Now that's what it looks like. Okay, now it's not, there's nowhere near done. Right, but we're going to at least show you exactly how quick it does play. Now it's got to stay in there longer to actually get the quality that we want. We try to do whatever we have to do to get the job done. And no matter if you're this small or if you're this big, the customer that is that small or that big means just as much to us. It just doesn't matter. Because the small customer can become this big customer. So we want to make sure we make everybody happy the best we can.